So welcome to my first YouTube video. If you can't tell, I'm really, really fucking nervous. We move. So today my video is going to be a sheen haul. Well, it's not just sheen actually. It's um runway sheen and runway are like they're like your eyebrows. They're sisters. They're not twins, but they're also they're not cousins. Um, apart from my eyebrows at the moment, are literal cousins. I only have half of them because um well TikTok told me to shave them off, so obviously I did. I do apologise about that. But yeah, anyway, I'm so excited. Like I literally ordered so many clothes since the beginning of lockdown. Like I've been going mad crazy. I don't know if I'm the only one. I was a shopaholic before, like an online shopaholic, but now it's intensified by like three million. The poor mum. Every time the doorbell goes again, I was like, oh, not another one. Anyway, yeah, so the main reason I wanted to do this video is because I know people can be really, really tentative to order from um, Sheen, Runway, Zaffle, places like that, which I understand because I was 100% like the first time ordering from there. Like I was really quite nervous about it. Obviously there's a shipping cost to return. I should mention I am actually an ambassador for Sheen, but I'm not being paid to do this. I haven't been asked to do it. And actually the reason I am a Sheen ambassador is because I love them so much like I've actually known for like my whole life and I literally messaged them on Instagram and was like oh my gosh like I love your clothes please look through my Instagram like you'll see I literally wear them in every single post like is there any way I can promote you and then I became part of the student ambassador team and I've loved it since I'm gonna be 100% completely honest I just wanna I literally just wanna share my love for Sheen I'm giving you the incentive today go order that Sheen but yeah I'm so excited so yeah let's get started first thing I want to show is oh my god velvet scrunchies in literally every single colour Every girl needs a, a scrunchie for every outfit. So yeah, we have these um, trousers, which are basically like, look like trousers, but they're that, that shiny material, you know what I mean. Um, okay, right, so here they are on. They literally fit perfectly. Um, they're elasticated at the top and the bottom, so they give that like, good fit, you know. They're literally so comfy. Um, yeah, so these are definitely like a 10 out of 10 for me. Ooh, ooh, love it. All right, so I had to put these shoes on with them because I think they go so well because they've got that little bit of like red there. I don't even know what it says. <laughs> Catch me at the next road, didn't they? Oh, I wore them on my walk today. <laughs> if you do order shoes, um, defo size up because they are a little bit tight. But they're so funky. I'm literally so calm. Like I feel like I feel so comfortable. Like I'm wearing trackies. Like fuck me, I love them. They're comfortable. Um, so I've got these jeans which have like little diamantes down the side. Um, I also have these jeans, which are a bit of a darker shade. Okay, so these jeans, oh my god, I'm in love. I put on um, these other pair of shoes, which are like, oh, there we go. The camera's angling so you can see them. They've got like a little sparkle on them, and I just think that's fucking adorable. If you know me, I love anything glitter. These jeans were too big. And um, so I ordered this chain, like, clip-on belt which is a look as well as serving to fit my i'm overall really really happy with these okay so this band i think is like well in at the moment like everyone's loving a bit of butterflies i've added a chain here uh this was also obviously from sheen hi boys i have butterflies only thing i would say about band is they all come up quite big at the bottom and baggy so like if you're worried about them being baggy on you anyway, just order, just size down. Oh my days, this top is fucking cute. I'm getting proper brandy Melville vibes from it. Um, yeah, it's a little bit see-through. But... Right, this is one of those ones where, you know, you order and then you're waiting for it to come and you keep looking up the clothes that you've ordered and then you realise I don't actually want this. I quite like it on. It's all right. It's a little bit baggy. It's baggy here and it's like not the tightest, which like I said, I don't really like. Uh, but it goes really well with the scrunchie, so I'm probably going to have to wear it just to show off the scrunchie. Okay. Absolute banger this one. I want to wear it all day, every day. I fucking love it. It's just so cute. It's so small. It's so flattering. And it has an angel on like me. Angel in the streets. Devil in the sheep. Not that there'll be any boys watching this. Unfortunately, I'm not really a fan of this one. It's also irritating me because I don't know which scrunchie it matches best. I don't know. Two? No, I look like a dickhead. It's a bit baggy here, which like makes it a bit... And high neck. Oh my god, I just, I do not suit high neck. My hair's too thick to suit high neck. Because my hair's like not flat. And like people, people who wear high necks and they have like really flat, like long, lovely hair. I'm like, wow, that looks banging. And then on me, I'm like, yeah, you look like an absolute tit. 
I am so gassed right now. <laughs> An absolute painting. I ordered this in blue and purple because obviously I'm greedy. They're trying to be like juicy because you know you have like the velvet ones and then they say juicy on them uh, in Diamantes. Yeah, let me have a little spice after that. I think it's very cute. It's so comfortable. It fits perfectly. It was £4.50. It also comes in pink. I didn't order it in pink because I made myself a velvet pink top the other day, which was like, oh god, I didn't change scrunchie. Perfect. This is why we buy scrunchies now. Oh my god, it matches my earrings too. This was from Runway, by the way. This wasn't from Sheen. I don't think they have them in Sheen. I think they only have them on Runway. I just clocked. I left one of my fave tops at home. So basically, this house that we're standing in now is my real house, which burned down um, months ago. And then obviously we went into lockdown, so my house couldn't get fixed. Um, so I'm living in some absolute shite hole with like blue carpets, it's fucking disgusting. And my room, so this is my, my actual room at home, but like it's not as pink as it normally is. My room, so I don't have like good spaces to film. This one, like, like I feel like I'm in an empty studio because all we've had done is the walls and the floor. I'm really sorry about the aesthetic. And that's why I had to bring all my clothes here. I literally turned up with boxes and suitcases. My neighbours are thinking, what the fuck is she doing? She can't live in there. It's been toasted to a crisp. I'm really jarred off about that, but I'm gonna attach, I'll see if I can attach a picture of me in the top. Right, here it is in blue as well. We haven't really talked much about it because I've just fucking babbled on about that. Did anyone else get told when they were younger, like, the more you talk, the bigger your brain gets? Or was that just my parents chatting shit to me? Love these. I'd get it in pink as well, I'm probably gonna order it. So I'm aware there's a lot going on here. Um, so this dress, oh, oh my days. I literally love, I wore, Hi, some high socks and the same shoes I still got on. Loved it and then I accessorised it with these hoop earrings. Whole pack of them from She. These necklaces are literally to die for. They were like two pound for both. The bandana's kind of giving me like Dior Gucci vibes. The dress goes down to here, but um, I'm just a massive slag, so I roll mine up. I hope you love this outfit as much as I do. <laughs> So this dress I had to put on an orange lighting because it's very see-through and I don't, I'm not going to lie, for me it's not very flattering. It is our, it's our uterus, it's our uterus, don't feel subconscious girls, we all have it. My theme, I put on a butterfly choker as well, unfortunately one of the butterflies fell off. It's, it's, it's really comfy and it's lovely material, um, I thought my, I thought my boob was coming out then. Fuck, I'm about to get cancelled before I even do it. Oh my god, I literally adore this. I think it's so cute, it's so in. This is my favourite material so far, like this material is banging, like it's so comfortable, this is so soft, and it's really, really thick. Right, so this came as a two-piece, so I'm gonna show it to you as a two-piece. I literally saw it and I was like, I love that top and I love that skirt and I could definitely wear them with other things. Oh, need to change my scrunchie. That's better, is it? Mm. Yeah, that's the one. Oh my days, I had to put these two together, but also, fucking guess. I'm a Jane for Scrunchie. Cow print, cow print's like really, really in at the moment. I saw this as a bikini top and I was like, fuck it, I would wear that as a top because as I mentioned before, I wear fuck all. If you see me on a night out in like trousers, you'd be like, it's pretty good, bro. Uh, the flares are literally paying. They're like perfect. I always find, even though I have short legs, any flares I buy, like, um, I still feel like they're too, sh they're too, like, short. Like, I always get, I always get really, like, I don't know. I don't know why they're too short, because I'm literally, I'm, like, two foot tall. Five foot on a good day. Yeah, this bucket hat as well, fuck me. Five pound for this bucket hat. I'm going to show you the other one. That was horrible lighting. You can never have too many bucket hats. Fucking hell, this is making me want to go festival so bad. Fuck my life. I'm in love. Be so casual, they could be so dressy. You could wear them festival, like to a festival. God, my grandma was terrible there. You could wear them to a festival, or you could literally wear like I'd wear these library every day with like an oversized like jumper or whatever. Speaking of which, I'm going to show you my hoodie next. I love it. Oh, you bastard! Oh, I didn't realise I was filming that. That wasn't directed towards anyone, unless my brother's watching this. I cannot be the only one who is in love with this. Like, this is just a bit of me. Mate, it's fucking pain. I love the colour of it as well. The colour didn't look like this on the website, but um, it's actually like exactly what I, what I want. Like I feel like it 
you can't really see, but my eyes are like quite blue, normally this ring light isn't really doing them bit. I would fucking shag this. Okay. okay, so these two, I wouldn't actually pair together, but they fuck, sorry about the makeup stain now, but they fucking work. So it comes with like a little strappy belt, obviously you could like wear your own belt with it. Literally, this is so paint, it's so thick, it's proper like denim material. I think it was one of the most expensive ones I bought. It, I think it was 16 pounds, it's got pockets, bro, it's got pockets. Oh my God, I need to stop talking like a child, sorry. <laughs> Roll it up a bit, shock. This is a very basic bitch top, but I love the milkmaid looks. I think they're just to die for. These shoulders are perfect amount of puffy. This little look up here, the only thing is you can see my bra box. See, if you have big enough boobs to wear a uh, bra, but I'm part of the itty bitty titty committee, so I cannot wear that bra. I also want to accessorize with this clip. This clip was literally like, I don't know, like two pounds or something. Right, let me see if I can put this in my hair. Okay, so I'm not the best with putting this clip in. If anyone wants to tell me where it should be, that would be great. It's giving me brunch vibes and we love a brunch, girls brunch. Also, I really apologise about the colour of my hair because a few days ago I tried to dye it silver because like the ends are really silver but the top of my hair is like yellow. Um, and I tried to dye it and it just went even more yellow, kind of orange. Oh my god, it's terrible. Blame my mum, my mum did it. I've also got a whole YouTube of it which I might upload but I'm waiting until like I've probably finished it so the end result is nice so that Brad Mondo doesn't kill me. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm literally such a dumb bitch. Today I so I ordered some toner, like the Weller one. Did it, and I came and I got a video of me being like, I don't know why it's so small. Like, I don't understand how this is supposed to go on my head. And then I left and read the instructions. I came back and I was like, I'm dickhead. Like, obviously you're supposed to buy a developer, not just the toner. I took a fat L there. Lol. Oh my days, we have another brunch top, girls. Literally so petting. The only thing is, it's very very creased, and I don't know with this material whether you can iron it. The jeans, these are the jeans I didn't show you before. They're not as pang as the other ones. Like, okay, thank you. You can see all my mess on the floor now. This little chain, I ordered this, this was like a pound. I probably wouldn't put it with these jeans because of the Diamantes, it's a bit like March. Okay, so you probably couldn't wear a bra with this either. That's a bit bait. Jeans, yeah, not my biggest fan. I can't really bend down and they look very, they're very, very tight. Oh my god, my arms are so hairy. I'm so sorry, I haven't cut them in so long. These skirts are so in at the moment. I wanted to order the one which was like kind of a rip-off Burberry colour, so it's like that beige tartan skirt. Um, but they didn't have it in my size. But I hope you love it. It's a perfect fit around my waist. I was so excited about this top. It's, it's not it, I can't lie, it's really not it. This is it unscrunched. It's just too big. It should be like this. Okay, here's one I forgot about, and I think I forgot about it because I don't actually like it that much. It's really baggy. It just doesn't fit, sorry, it does not go with these trousers, but it clearly doesn't fit very well. I'm showing off my bra line. But unfortunately, this is the last clothing item I have to show you. Um, it's a really cute blue tracksuit. Actually, a blue scrunchie, obviously. It fits literally so well. I matched it with these shoes. Okay, it's gonna go down for me, thank you, man. But, but, maybe they are too small. I don't know if I ordered the wrong size, always check, or I sent the wrong size, but they are definitely not my size. Like, my feet are being cramped right now. It's like a lollipop in a water bottle situation, if you know what I mean. Like, I think this is a cool look and tracksuits, I fucking love them. This is like my library look as well. Um, if I ever go back to university. So here's the first side bag I had. It's a really cute person. I absolutely adore this. It's a little over the shoulder or you can hold it in your hand. But yeah, it's got good storage. This is a longer one. Um, it's similar sort of pattern, but it's really good as well. It's got the same amount of storage really, but it's just a little bit of a softer material. This is a three part necklace. Don't know why I got an A. It was a mistake. It either stands for my best friend, Anna or Angel. But this one actually does say Angel and is definitely my favourite chain. Okay, so thank you to anyone that watched all seven of you. Probably that's something there is. Thanks, mum. Love you. I really hope this video just people to shop from Sheen and not feel nervous about it. As you can see from this video, like it is good quality. There are some things which, yeah, I wasn't that happy with, but I feel like that happens with every order. But yeah, anyway, thank you for watching, and there'll definitely be so many more videos to come. Uh, hope everyone's surviving lockdown well. Stay positive and stay online shopping. We'll definitely be doing a lot more online shopping, so there'll be probably a lot more hauls to come. But yeah, anyway, take care, everyone.